Today, I will be using the last 20 cover athletes in Madden history from Madden 2006 all the way up to Madden 25, which means we got a lot of work to do, starting with Madden NFL 06. And the cover athlete of Madden 06 is Donovan McNabb at a 97 overall. And real quick, everyone, I just want to say that about 90% of the people watching this video right now are not even subscribed, so if you want more videos, make sure to subscribe to the channel. So a few things. We are here with Donovan McNabb on the field, and obviously we're going to try to throw a touchdown with him. Now, we're going to go for 5,000 likes on this video. And if we get 5,000 likes, I'm going to buy every Madden game to about the year 2000, maybe even earlier for when Madden 25 does release. I include as many Maddens as possible. Second thing is that if you hear an airport in the background, that is just the Xbox 360. It's a super old console and it makes a lot of noise. McNabb going downfield. Almost had a man, and if my voice drops off a little bit, it's because I try to suppress the 360 noise, and sometimes that takes effect on the microphone. So if my mic cuts in and out during these 360 games, I do apologize. We're trying to go deep, and that one's incomplete. Got a fourth and one here. I'm going to try to pick up one yard with Brian Westbrook in the backfield, which we're easily going to do, and Westbrook gonna go he could go all the way but we're trying to throw a touchdown we're getting the end zone with McNabb so I'll step out of bounds that was nice to see so we're at the two yard line now and McNabb throws a touchdown and that's our first cover athlete done next up is Madden NFL 07 the cover athlete for Madden NFL 07 is Sean Alexander who was a 98 overall for the Seattle Seahawks we got Sean Alexander in the backfield and Sean Alexander this man was a problem for any team competing against him and Alexander takes it all the way a former NFL MVP at the running back spot maybe the last running back to win it too just went I think over 50 yards for the score Next up, Madden 08. The cover athlete of Madden 08 is QB Vince Young from the Titans. Let's find out what Vince Young could do. And it looks like they have superstar abilities in this game. If Vince Young makes that throw, that's insane. Oh, what a catch. What a grab. Vince Young, I think, has like an X factor in this game. They had some sort of abilities in Madden 08. And then they brought him back 12 years later and called him a new feature. I want to try to get out of the pocket with Vince Young and scramble a little bit. Looks like we're going to have an opportunity. Throw some blocks down the field. Vince don't fumble. Okay, he'll take it inside the 15. Vince Young, let's see. Can we get in the end zone with him or we got to throw it? Oh, we had a wide open receiver. I think it was David Givens B right there. It was going to be wide open if I had one extra second. Need to pick up a first down or the touchdown. And we're picked off after a great first few plays. Throwing a Hail Mary at this point. Cannot find our way into the end zone right now with Vince Young. Pressure from this Packers team is insane, and Charles Woodson has picked it off one-handed. What is going on in this game? Throw it up. Please give me something. David Gibbons! Oh, he caught it! What an insane grab! Just get in the end zone. Let's go. Waste no time. Waste absolutely no time. I cannot believe he caught that football. Play action fake. That's what... Okay. And Vince... Run in. Thank you very much. Now for Madden NFL 09. And we have 99 overall Brett Favre. Okay, well, we got Brett Favre here. And on the cover of Madden 09, he is on the Green Bay Packers. But I think like halfway through the season, he's actually on the cover for the Jets. I put him on the Packers, though, because that's the cover that I have. But I do believe he played for the Jets this season. So I don't know what you want to make of that. And what might be even funnier is that I didn't even realize I picked him to be the QB against the Jets in this game. But there's a touchdown for Brett Favre in the end zone here in Lambeau for the last time in the snow. Next up is Madden 10. However, Madden 10 is one of the few games in this video that will feature two different cover athletes. We have 99 overall Troy Polamalu of the Pittsburgh Steelers. We have 99 overall Larry Fitzgerald for the Arizona Cardinals. Well, I'm going to be using Troy Polamalu for a few plays since he's on defense. Obviously, we're not going to score a touchdown with him offensively, but maybe we can make a play with him defensively. And what a throw that was. Polamalu was known for like jumping the play though at the snap count i don't know could i leap over and tackle kurt warner i know could i time this up come on palomalu that's good enough and palomalu comes in and makes a shoestring tackle One more play stop them from getting the first palomalu stop them from getting the first here comes troy palomalu nope. oh i missed wildly i think that's enough for troy let's move on to larry Cheryl was no doubt the best receiver in this game 99 overall there was a lot of great receivers back then but larry was the best where would you rank Larry Fitzgerald? All time. Look at Larry Fitzgerald. What a grab. I think he had like more tackles in his career than he had drops. Fitzgerald one-on-one -on -one to the outside to the right here. Troy is going to be back there, but Larry actually can't get off the line of scrimmage. We're going to toss it to him anyway. 
<laughs> what a catch by Larry Fitzgerald. Palomalu missed the interception. I got to see that again. Balls in the air. Palomalu threw his hands and in the end zone's Larry. Now for the man in 11 cover athlete. Got a 99 overall Drew Brees. Let's see what 99 overall Drew Brees can do. We have to have a wide open. Oh, first play. Anderson. Drew Brees, 99 overall, equals a one-play touchdown. Next up, Madden NFL 12. In Madden 12, we had the Cleveland and Peyton Hillis. Okay, let's see what Peyton Hillis could do on the ground here in Cleveland. He's getting to the outside. He got absolutely drilled by the Giants defense. We haven't used the running back since Sean Alexander. Sean Alexander scored pretty easily. Will Hillis be able to get to the outside? Break a tackle, and he could go if we get that blocking downfield, which we do. And Peyton Hillis is in for the touchdown. Final Xbox 360. Madden with Madden 13. We got a 99 overall Megatron in Madden 13. Actually going step for step with him, but he's got the size. Calvin, it probably should have been picked off. Calvin, you got to jump for that. So just go quick pass. Try a quick slant. Megatron over the middle, and he's got it. I got him the quick pass, and now I'm going back to the deep pass. I'm going to try to air this thing out. Let Megatron go get it. Let the CPU catch it. I bet you Megatron will get it. Okay, never mind. Nothing crazy from Calvin yet, but we're first and goal, or second and goal, rather, from the nine. Maybe the slant route will be it. Calvin over the middle, and he's in for the touchdown. Next up, we head to Madden 25. By Madden 25, I mean the one from 10 years ago with AP on the cover. And Adrian Peterson was a 99 overall in this game. Well, I normally never play defense in this. I just let the CPU do it, and I simulated so we're on offense. And it looks like we actually got some great field position here as I'm giving the ball to AP. AP breaking a tackle, running over some other Titan defenders and picked up about 10. I'm going right here with AP. We went left, worked out pretty well. This time we go right, and we're right into the end zone with Adrian Peterson. Another 99 overall, and this time it's Richard Sherman of Madden 15. All right, well, I'm using Richard Sherman here. I don't know what we're going to do with him. It's going to be pretty hard to score a touchdown or even get an interception because I can't control Matthew Stafford throwing the ball towards him. But I think instead the goal is going to be go for a three and out here. We're on Calvin Johnson. We'll see. I mean, it's a 99 overall receiver. You would imagine Matthew Stafford would force him the ball no matter what. And he got it to him. What a route by Calvin Johnson, too. Looks like they put Calvin Johnson on the other side of the field. So we're on Golden Tate here. We just got burned. And they got a first down. So we did not get the three and out. But let's get them off the field. Third and two. Trying to get them off the field, and we do just barely. Matthew Stafford with a bad throw. Next up, Madden 16. And we got a 94 Odell Beckham Jr. What's funny about this game is that Odell Beckham Jr., and honestly, anybody with the aggressive catch is an absolute glitch. Just like, look at this. We're going to throw it up to Odell. Okay, well, if Eli throws out of bounds like that, then we're not going to have a glitch. Let's keep the ball in bounds this time, Eli. And with then we could have a glitch. Okay. Take a look at this. The aggressive catch. An absolute glitch. Anybody can catch it ridiculously in this game. Let's go ahead. Let's throw this thing up. One more time, Eli. Oh, my goodness. Taken down. Send it. Odell. Touched. Touchdown. I thought maybe he was down at the one for a second. Didn't process. And it's just that easy with Odell in this game. And here we go in Madden 17. And the cover athlete, Rob Gronkowski. And Gronk is a 99 overall in this game. We've got ourselves a fourth and one. But we have... Maybe the best security blanket in NFL history for Tom Brady. And that is Gronkowski, who makes the grab already. And we are at the 28-yard line. Gronkowski on the cover of this game. And funny enough, Tom Brady will be on the cover next year. So we're going to have back-to-back -back New England Patriots. Maybe the GOAT at tight end. And definitely the GOAT at quarterback right now. Can Gronk get to that? No. Oh, Edelman almost caught that. Let's have Gronk cross the field here. He is open. If Brady can loft that ball over the defender, which he does perfectly puts us at the two yard line now it should be nice and easy just have Gronk come across the middle of the field pretty simple and we should be able to get in the end zone let's go play action they don't see it coming and there's Gronk not a flag please tell me that's on the defense what's the call holding we're really going back how does the CPU take a holding penalty it is what it is though Gronk corner route trying to get open Tom Brady oh Gronk how did he not come down with the ball there tipped was in his hands, wasn't able to grab it, which actually is pretty surprising, honestly. Come on, Gronk, just get in the end zone. I think a streak should work. I think it should work. It's not gonna work. It does work, it's Gronk, why do I doubt it? Next, we got Madden 18, and we move straight to Madden 18 with Tom Brady on the cover. Well, this time around, I do not have to score with Rob Gronkowski because it's Brady on the cover, not Gronk. I just gotta get in the end zone with the Patriots. 
And we're going to see. I'm trying to use those blocks. And we do get the first down, I believe. Should be the first down right there. We were kind of carried over the first down marker. But we could score with any of these Patriots that I want. The question is, who is it going to be? It might be Gronk again. I wouldn't even lie to you. I won't even lie. Brandon Cooks is on this team, though. He's got a lot of speed. I can maybe send him down the field and let him go get this football. He might get that. Oh, come on. He had him. What was that? That is absurd. That's a touchdown. You got to be kidding me with that. I'm taking that same shot again. But this time, I'm just going to throw it nice and quick to Brandon Cooks because there was a safety over the top in the middle. We weren't able to hit the long ball, but we did pick them apart for about a 30-yard gain, so I will take that. And it might be Gronk right here on a corner route score on this touchdown. Wouldn't surprise me at all. And it is Gronk who gets the score again. Madden 19, it's Antonio Brown of the Pittsburgh Steelers. AB was a 99 overall in his prime. When it comes to AB right here, I mean, you put AB's prime up against any other receiver in NFL history, and he obviously can't compete. He's a top five wide receiver probably of all time. I really think so. We'll have to see what happens with his Hall of Fame ballot if he gets in based off off the field things. But if you take his on the field work, there is no doubt he is arguably a top five wide receiver. You might even put him in. I don't know. Where would you rank Antonio Brown? That'll be a question in the comments down below that I would like to see answered. And there's AB making a ridiculous catch. Was that one-handed and stayed on his feet? He was able to lead the league in any of the major receiving categories that you wanted. You want him to have the most receptions in a year? He can do that. The most yards for a year? He can do that. And touchdowns. He could really do it all. He can go deep. He can catch it immediately. Short. What a catch over Richard Sherman. A different Madden cover athlete. And AB with the touchdown just like that. Next up is Madden 20. We got Patrick Mahomes as a 97 overall at Bazooka X factor. Mahomes can throw the ball basically the entire field. You have Tyree Kill that obviously could run past every single person on this field. And you're going to have Mahomes hit him right there. What was that? Hold on, though, because I was saying this was going to be super easy because this game is such a glitch with Mahomes and Hill. But we have to get this first down. And we're going to get sacked. That was terrible. Tyreek, I was just saying you could outrun any... What is going on? We're getting sacked like crazy. Tyreek Hill can't outrun anybody right now. What is happening in this game? Hit him. There it is. There it is. Why, Tyreek? Why'd you catch it like that? Where are we hitting here? What a catch by Sterling. Oh, my goodness. What a grab that was. You can't make that up. That was unbelievable. That's that Madden 20 I was talking about, being very arcadey. And now it could be Sammy Watkins over the middle for the touchdown. And this is the year of Lamar Jackson. And Lamar's a 91 overall, I believe, coming after his MVP season. Funny enough, Madden 21 is like the first ever Madden game that I really tried to make content on. It wasn't any good. Obviously, the content now is a lot better, but... This game, I guess, does have a little special place in my heart because I started my YouTube journey with this game. So we got to go ahead and we got to score a nice touchdown with Lamar. And on the ground already, that was a pretty nice run. And where are we going to go here? Where are we going, Lamar? Getting crazy again. Lamar Jackson, juking. Don't fumble. He's going to fumble. Possible end, possible end zone shot. It's Des Bryant. I forgot Des Bryant played for the Ravens. Did he? I think he actually played like one or two real games. I don't think he ever suited up for the Saints. He got injured. But Des Bryant played for the Ravens. I completely forgot about that. And we almost hit him for the score. There's Hollywood Brown. Hollywood Brown going to try to race to the end zone. Couldn't quite get there. That's Darius Slay from behind. But here we go, Lamar. We're going to try to get this touchdown on the ground with... Okay. Dobbins. To oh, if I scored this touchdown, that would have been insane. That's okay, though. Because what we're going to do now is roll out with Lamar. And we got a man. It's Hollywood Brown, I believe. Yes, it is for the touchdown. Next up is Madden 22. And Madden 22 is one of the two scenarios in this video where we do have two cover athletes. So we got to score with Patrick Mahomes and Tom Brady. Tom Brady on the Buccaneers is a 99 overall. And we got Mahomes at a 97. And we'll start with Brady here. We are in Tampa Bay, and then I'm going to switch sides. So I put the Chiefs on defense. May as well put them in the same game together. We're going to Mike Evans. That was Tom Brady's favorite receiver to throw to on the Buccaneers. So we had Brady on the Patriots in this video, and now we have him with the Bucs. Super Bowl champion with both. That is just ridiculous. Brady. Is that Tyler Johnson? Tyler Johnson. What a grab towards the 11-yard line. Brady just picking apart this Kansas City Chiefs defense like he did in the Super Bowl. 
We got Giovanni Bernard in the backfield, but I'm going to Evans. One on one. He's going to make that grab every time for the score. Well, for some reason, it didn't let me switch sides. So we're back in a new game here in Tampa Bay with Patrick Mahomes this time around. And where are we going to go? I actually want to go to Kelsey. I threw it deep on accident. That should have been a free pick for the CPU. They've actually knocked down a few of those or just not made the catch on some occasions in this video where they should have had interceptions. Except for with Vince Young. I got picked off so many times with Vince Young. I don't want to talk about it. But Mahomes, there's absolutely no way. He's got that type of air under that throw for 66 yards, pretty much, without Bazooka. And that was one heck of a user to stop running with Tyreek to make sure I secured that ball. And there's a touchdown for Travis Kelsey. I believe the flag is going to be on the defense. That's going to be pass interference, and that touchdown will stand. Next up is Madden 23 and John Madden. And for this game, I'm going to score a touchdown in the John Madden Showcase game. Correction, it's the John Madden Legacy game. So we have the John Madden Legacy game with an awesome intro. We're going to be taking over the AFC, and I just got to score a touchdown with them. It does not matter who scores it or how we score it. We are going to go on offense, though, as the NFC looks like they got a touchdown. So we got Brady on this team. Tyreek is back. I think that's Dante Hall. I think that's Andre Reed, Marcus Allen on the field. I guess pretty much an all-star team of players here. I'm not sure how Madden decided who would be on this team, but it's Tyreek from Brady for 42. Send this one to Tim. Tim from Brady. Dropping it in the bucket. What a throw by Tom for the John Madden Legacy game. Next up is Madden 24. And Josh Allen in Madden 24 is a 92 overall. No longer the newest cover athlete for a Madden game is Josh Allen, but we're still going to go ahead and we got to score a touchdown with him. And it feels like just yesterday I did this video scoring with Josh Allen as the new cover athlete. And for the final time, it's Stephon Diggs from Josh Allen. He's in Houston now. Josh Allen is no longer the cover athlete. It's going to be looking different in Buffalo next year. And to end the video, we have the Madden 25 cover athlete. But I don't know who that is yet because I recorded every other Madden here on Sunday. So I got to wait two days to find out who the cover athlete is. And we'll be back to use the final player. Two days later. The Madden 25 cover athlete has been announced and it's none other than Christian McCaffrey runs CMC of the San Francisco 49ers. And we got CMC on the field. Now this is Madden 24, not 25 because Madden 25 is not out yet. But I downloaded updated rosters. Somebody online made the updated rosters for us to download. So I was able to grab those. These will be the rosters headed into next season so we're going to go ahead and we're going to score a touchdown with christian mccaffrey and a very well deserved cover in my opinion i think mccaffrey might be the best player non-quarterback in the league funny enough also so we covered the earlier man at 25 in this video with adrian peterson on the cover now in this game we have McCaffrey on the cover. We haven't had a running back since AP. So both games named Madden 25 will have a running back on the cover, which I think is actually pretty cool. But right now, I got to focus on getting this first down with McCaffrey. We're fourth and five here. Purdy. We sent CMC up the field. Let it fly. Purdy hit him in stride. Christian McCaffrey, what a grab. That is CMC for you. He can run it. He can catch it. And I'm honestly surprised he didn't break away all the way and go for six. But now we can go back on the ground. We need some better blocking here. Now let's see if we can go stretch left and punch this thing in the end zone. I got a good feeling that we can. No! You got to hold that block, Ayuk. We had McCaffrey for the touchdown if he holds that corner for one extra second. Now it's fourth and inches. I got to get a yard. We'll get a yard, and we'll get the whole thing. Touchdown for the Madden 25 cover athlete, CMC. That's going to do it for the video, everyone. If you enjoyed it, do me a favor by hitting the like button and subscribing to the channel. And I'll talk to you all in the next one. Peace.